being so so well today if you're new here welcome to my channel and i'm so happy that you're here for today's video i have a what i got for christmas that i'm very grateful i've said this for years that you know i don't ever expect anything for christmas and when i do get something it means the world to me that somebody thought about buying things for me and it just means a lot so let's just get into it and i hope that you enjoy so starting off i wish it was more organized but really i started putting my gifts away and then i was like oh my gosh i have to film that video so i don't have everything here but i was able to collect most of the things that i got it'll kind of be in a random order but as i show you the item i'll tell you who it's from i got this bonnet it's a sleeping cap because i've been really wanting to take way more better care of my hair i feel like i've been good at it for the past you know well my whole life my mom's a hairdresser so I feel like I have, have the upper hand. I'm very grateful that my mom has taught me how to take care of myself and my hair. This has like been really big actually on like TikTok for all sorts of people. It's something that a lot of people have suggested to use no matter what kind of hair type you have. And so I thought it would be something nice to try. I do have the silk um, or like the satin pillowcases which help. And this one is a premium silky fabric and it's like a fun like leopard cheetah print and i thought this was oh yeah this is leopard i was like is this cheetah or leopard it is leopard i don't know if i'll use this every night but i think it'll be nice when i'm doing like an overnight heatless look i did sock curls and like this side turned out a little bit better than this side i think it'll be really nice to just take really good care of my hair and again so many people have talked about it they have all different types of hair types and they've um, all said that it's really great to use so that's why I was excited to try it and then she also got me these uh, peppermint hot cocoa from Starbucks like it's kind of like an ornament almost and they're just like the little hot cocoa mixes which I thought was fun to try and then she also got me this night glow book light so this is my third book light that I have I might keep this one or maybe I'll gift it to one of you guys in the future I might do a giveaway or something but this one is really cool it's actually quite big and it clamps on and it's like a nice warm light and I think this is from like the 90s or something but I love it and I think It'll be fun to try in comparison to the other ones I have. She also got me this Bath & Body Works gift set. So it has a hand sanitizer and then um, a body spray and a lotion. The body spray and the lotion are in A Thousand Wishes. And then the hand sanitizer is in the Scent Champagne Toast. Which all those smell so delicious. And those are really fun to have around. And then she also got me this Sweet Vanilla Eggnog. Uh, hemp's treats lotion which this smells so divine and these are really great for throwing in your purse she also got me a coffee gift card and i think that's what i got for my mom from my uncle i got this von mar gift card which is super exciting i've never shopped there before but this is so cool to watch like how fun is that from a family friend i got this norwegian light a visual and poetic tapestry book and I think it's a book that like someone they know wrote and it's just a really cool like you flip through it and I'm Norwegian and Scandinavian so this is just really cool to look through and something fun to have might be a good like coffee table book and I don't have all the gifts for my friends I don't know what I did with all of them I must have put them all away like I was saying earlier so um one of my friends she made me a bunch of earrings out of polymer clay which I shared in a what to get people for Christmas video so if you want to see like an idea of what they looked like it's two videos ago but she also got me two books she got me I think it's called the dead romantics or maybe it was the midnight library it's one of those two and then she got me the last thing he told me by Laura Dave but I've heard really good things about this book and I'm excited to read that one and for my friend Gabby both my friend Megan and I got us she got us electric lighters which those are so great to have and they're rechargeable super easy to use and she got me a jelly cat moon which if you know anything about me i love moons i have a moon tattoo i just love anything celestial um it goes back to honestly since i was like a kid i just love the moon the stars the sun everything so um, i don't have a jelly cat but i was so excited to have one and it's the cutest thing so this little guy has been sitting on my bed. It's just so cute. If you don't have a jelly cat, I strongly recommend. They're the cutest things ever. I think adults and children alike will love them. And then she also got me a Carhartt hat, which I love this one. She got me the one with like the nice matching like leather patch. And I'm just so excited to have another one that is a different color. I have a green one as well that I got last year for my mom. This one's just so pretty. So I love this a lot and I'm excited to wear this one. And we live in Minnesota and I think hats are always super useful. And for my best friend Megan, this is from memory. She got us both, my friend Gabby and I, not matching but 
the same cup but like a different pattern uh those gl like the glass pop can cups with like the wooden lid and a glass straw and it's so cute i got uh like a checkered green print and i've already been using it i love it and in the same vein as that i got another one of those cups but it has moons and suns on it from my friend jesse and i've been using that one too religiously so those i either might show you like b-roll footage of it or maybe i'll pop up a picture of what it might look like megan also got me this strawberry planter slash vase it says it's a vase it's a strawberry field vase which is super cute and she's like you could use it for anything and i'm like this is so cute and i have one other vase and i think this will be perfect for when i live on my own and i can have a cute little strawberry vase <laughs> I love that. And for my mom's boyfriend, I got a coffee gift card, which will be nice to use. And then I got these hokas for my sister Loren. She asked us if there was anything that we wanted that was practical um, and that we would use. And I actually don't have any new tennis shoes. I've been wearing my mom's old ones and they've been really hurting my feet. Which goes to show that like having your own nice tennis shoes that form to your feet are amazing. And I'm a big thrifter, you know that. And I thrift all of my shoes basically and i sent her a few different options not even on, like i also sent her i think a pair of like brooks um shoes like different price ranges and stuff because i'm like that's a lot of money to spend but she's like i love hokas and i want you to have some so these are just a really fun like beige color which um i just feel like these will be nice like i love the really fun colored ones and maybe as like i wear these and i know that i love them maybe i'll get a, like a really funky colored pair but for now i thought this was like really good for like everyday kind of use and it will go with almost any outfit and for my sister sarah oh also from Lauren, she made us these cute little like goodie bags so there's uh jelly bellies in here the andy's like cookie mints these are so good she got us an r and co dart pomade stick which this is so cool i was like wait what's this for and she goes like to put your like flyaways back and i'm like this is going to be a game changer because i have like wavy curly hair and when i try and like do updos i get all these like little ringlets under my hair which like they're cute and fun but sometimes you want that slicked back look so this will be great and then she also got us these vacation so vacation is such a fun brand they have like the whipped spf and then they have i have their perfume it smells so good and she got us the vacation lip balm desserts line and it's the strawberry jello salad which is so fun and kitsch and I just I love that so really really excited about that stuff and then for my sister Sarah um she got me a hot cocoa bomb and this hot cocoa spoon here we go super fun and uh, obviously my family knows I like hot chocolate I actually haven't really had any this year so considering it's 2024 I haven't had any but in 2023 I did not have that many and then um, I saw this in there and I was like, oh my gosh, like so from the, like I was looking down and it was like a dim lit room. I'm like, is this like a pair of those fake teeth that you put in your mouth? So like our family, we used to have them. They were like those, I think you could get them in like the little 25 cent things at like the uh, gas station and the grocery stores but they were like these little fake teeth and they were like funky looking stuff. I thought that this is what this was. And I was laughing so hard and then I'm opening it up. It is not what that was. It is this cute croissant. <laughs> so like taking the perspective of what I thought it was and then it's this. Like I was cracking up so hard. But it's a little croissant hair clip. And this is by the brand Jenny Lemons. Which I just think they're so cute. They kind of remind me of like a Chunks. They're very well made. Super durable. I can't even open it. It's like so strong. But this will be cute for like a little half up do's uh i said that's so weird half up do's but this will be so fun she got me this take a pour pour solution blackhead scrub stick and it's like a little octopus how cute is that and it's by tony moly and she also got me this makeup eraser. I took it out to like show people because they were wondering what it was. But if you don't have a makeup eraser, this is really great. And they also have a knockoff one at the Dollar Tree and it works just as good. But I'm excited to have another one and it's brown so it probably won't show as many stains. I have a pink one and the Dollar Tree ones, they used to only have pink ones. So I have like three of those. It's a great way to take off makeup um, with just water. Got me some Pocky sticks, which are fun. And a Collagen by Real Beauty mask. 
And then she got me a pen and an Opal House journal. And then she wrote something in here and she's like, I just want you to have like a journal to write about like your day. And I've been journaling since I was in like first grade, which I know sounds a little silly, but it's true. I have some journals from like that are dated 2004, 2005, 2006. And I was six in 2004. I was journaling for a long time and it makes sense that I went to school to be a journalist. I love journaling and I am almost done with one that I have been using for the past two years. I don't journal every day. I wish I could do it every day but sometimes I just forget. And um, so I actually don't have another one, like a backup one, so this will be perfect for that. And I saw that she wrote me a little note in there so I'll read it when I open this journal up to use it but super excited about that. And that is everything I got for Christmas. I know I'm missing a few things. My friend Katrina got us all a bottle of wine and then she got me an Alice in Wonderland puzzle which is so cool and I love it and I wish I had it here to show you but I put it away and I didn't think about it until now but I hope that you enjoyed today's video and comment down below what you got for Christmas whether you know or whatever holiday you celebrate if you got gifts or anything of any sort if it's your birthday or was your birthday in December I want to know what you got I always love seeing what people get because it's so fun um just like the thought that goes behind gift giving is so wonderful and I personally love to give gifts so it was such a fun season and um I love just seeing people's faces and like it's just so fun. So thank you so much for watching. I'm so grateful for all of you. I really hope that 2024 is really wonderful for you and that you get everything that you wish for. So I'll see you in my next video. Until then, shine bright. Bye. Mm -hmm.